My name is John Boyne. I'm an Irish writer. I'm the author of the novel The Boy in the Striped Pyjamas. I'm very excited to see this novel being turned into a ballet by Northern Ballet. The thing that happens as a writer is you get an idea and it just seems too powerful to walk away from. For me, the idea started with a very simple image. Two boys sitting on either side of a fence, talking to each other. I knew where the fence was. I knew it was a place that nobody should be, let alone two little boys. But I was interested in the journey that would bring them there, the conversations they would have, and the necessary end that I felt their story would reach. I wanted the fence almost to be a character of its own in the book. It almost acts as a mirror at times, because the more the boys get to know each other, when they visit each other every day, they tend to mimic each other's actions. When one stands up, the other stands up. When one sits down, the other sits down. There was a moment where Bruno looks across and he sees people wearing what he perceives to be uniforms of striped pyjamas, and he references this to his sister Gretel. And when I was writing the book, I thought this was going to be a very important image. I did a lot of research on the clothes that inmates at the camps were wearing, the different types of clothes, the different badges that signified whether you were a Jew, whether you were a homosexual, whether you were a gypsy. And I tried to incorporate as much of that into the story as I possibly could. You can take an idea such as this extraordinary genocide that took place, this Holocaust in the 1940s, and you can narrow it down and look at how things are happening today. When the book was first published, the editor of the book wrote a line on the, on the, on the inside cover saying, fences like this exist all over the world. We hope you never have to reach such a fence. And the problem is in 2017, more and more of us are in fact reaching fences like this at a time when we feel people should really be past all of that idea of difference.